let's have a look at another example on dividing and exponents. If we have to tackle something like this, remember we just go step by step and first we work out what 15 divided by 3 is and that is 5. We then move on to our x's and we use our exponent rule which tells us we go x to the 6 minus 2. We then move on to the y's and we go y to the 3 minus 5. And so we get 5 x to the 4 and then here we've got 3 minus 5 which is negative 2. Now this is a perfectly decent answer but in many cases they'll want us to write it all with positive exponents and if they do want to make all everything with positive exponents we just need to remember what y to the power of minus 2 means. It means 1 over y squared. So 5x to the 4 y to the minus 2 is the same as 5x to the 4 over y squared.